Hey guys, it's Tech Racer and today I'm going to take a look at the Oxygenos Open Beta 28 for the OnePlus 5T and 30 for the OnePlus 5. So today in the morning I got the update. So let's go to setting, uh, system update. As you can see the update size is of 454 megabytes and I have already downloaded the update and as you can see this is the changelog. So let's quickly apply the update and let's take a look at the changelog also. So the phone has been booted as you can see so let's uh, greet the agreement so guys as you can see the phone has been booted and as you can see system has been updated so let's quickly jump into the settings go to about phone and as you can see it's open beta 28 the android version is 9 and the security patch is of 1st april 2019 so we have latest security patch so let's quickly go to system updates so as you can see first of all we have the updated android security patch to 2019.4 so that's april 2014 we have already seen it then we have improved network speed display as you can see now we have different type of network speed meter which is at the top of the status bar then we have supported shortcut access corresponding to the interface in quick setting so let's see the quick setting so now we can just press and hold the quick setting in order to jump to the settings this feature was previously available but uh, now this feature has been available to other options as well so let's try to oh, auto rotate as you can see now we are going to settings of the auto rotate as well so that's the new implementation then we have quick reply in landscape mode again and this feature was previously available in the update but you can enable it again from utilities then quick reply in landscape and as you can see we can enable it from here and the supported apps are listed here so that's pretty good thing then we have few updates in the launcher application so added tutorials in shelf added parking locations feature and the improved page indicator so let's go to the launcher as you can see this is the oneplus launcher if we swipe left we get to the oneplus shelf and as you can see uh, at the bottom we have the parking location service so this is the new widget for that you have to go to settings and you can enable that parking location from here so once you enable it just scroll down and you will see parking location here so once you park any vehicle you can just take a picture of that location and you can also mark the location so whenever you want to just pick back your vehicle then you can simply track using this option so that's pretty good thing then you have improved page indicator to mirror the icon pack so let's quickly go to home so this is the launcher as you can see now if we just slide through the home screen as you can see there is an animation uh, which shows the page number uh, so let's try to change the icon pack right now and let's choose the square the icon pack has been set as you can see now let's try to change the home screen as you can see now we have different type of uh, page scrolling so that was the change in the launcher so yeah guys this is it for this video guys if you found this video really helpful then do that like button and subscribe button and stay tuned for more such videos. So thank you guys thanks for watching.